Zombies in a war? I feel like you've seen this before. It's day 26 of 31 days of horror and we are watching the movie Valley of the Dead. When I saw Netflix had a new zombie movie that takes place during the Spanish Civil War, I had to watch it. I don't know why, but zombies in war is such a fun fit and maybe it's because I played so much COD zombies as a kid. That being said, this genre has been done a lot with some really good standouts like Overlord and Dead Snow. So how does this one compare? To be honest, it's a pretty basic zombie flick. This is a horror comedy Spanish film with a runtime of 1 hour and 40 minutes long. Netflix gives you the option to watch it in dub or sub, and of course I watched it in dub because that's what I always do. The main story is we follow Captain John and his ally as they cross enemy lines to deliver some intel when they run across some opposing soldiers. When him and his ally are being captured by them, they stumble across this dead airborne soldier and they realize he's not quite dead. but an undead zombie. What this movie does interesting is the virus that is created by the Germans is actually contained in some type of blue gas grenade. This turns pretty much anybody who inhales this gas into zombies. These zombies are what I like to call bullet sponges. They can take round after round and not go down and they only die to a gunshot to the head. Also the blood in this movie is kind of weird like the actors who are playing the zombies have blood on them but anytime they get shot it's just blood mist. It makes me feel like I'm watching old YouTube videos of Corridor Digital seeing a bunch of blood mist shoot off of people. A lot of times it's mostly digital or just practical blood mist, but I don't know why we don't see any liquid or any type of blood interact with the environment around them. But like I said before, this is a horror comedy and it tries to be funny a lot in this movie, but I just found myself only chuckling a few times. If you're going to be campy, then you need to full send it and not half ass it like this movie does. I just feel like they could have had a lot better jokes and done some really funny gags, but they just didn't. They also could have given us an interesting cast of colorful characters, and while you think they do with some characters with weird names like priest killer they don't speaking of the chick named priest killer they make it a point in the movie to never say her name even the very end you never know her name but for whatever reason on imdb they have her apparent real name in the credits which is kind of odd john is a fast talking always joking main character and i just wish he had some better jokes the action was fun but again it's not over the top campy or super violent so it's not really memorable sadly this is just another zombie flick that does nothing special and is pretty basic on a scary meter this gets a 0 out of 10 on a blood meter this gets a 5 out of 10 and this is why i give valley of the dead a 6 out of 10 if you guys like this video hit that like button if you guys want to see more hit that follow button and as always thanks for watching